What up, YouTube? This is Woody coming back with another ride review. We're here today again at the 2017 Amp Expo in Columbus, Ohio. To the, this time, we're going to ride the GSXR 750 2018. Uh, I tried to look up specs on this while I was sitting here waiting for my turn to ride the bike, and uh, I couldn't find any. So I'm not sure about the horsepower or the torque or anything like that. But I've been waiting for a while trying to get on a on a Suzuki. I can't never make it to demo days. They're demo days. They have them all the time, but I can't. For whatever reason, I can't never get a chance to go ride one. So kind of pumped about riding this today. Do what? Jacob, right? Sean. Sorry. Sean. Sean. Okay, perfect. Okay. Any questions on the GSXR? I don't think so. Okay. Thank you. Let's start this bad boy up. Which one has got a plate? Which one has got a Gear indicator. It's got a gear indicator, but neutral. I don't know if that means neutral is zero. I don't know. What's this? Trips. Whatever that is, it's got the time on it. it looks like the time's wrong because it says 9.20 and it is 1.30. It is hotter than crap out here today, boys and girls. It is so freaking hot. It's 90 some degrees. The humidity is way, way up. Uh, let's see, let's talk about the bike. Uh, as you see, this is one of those bikes that you have to hold in the clutch to start. Uh, I am 6'1". 195 pounds uh, I've got about a 36 inch inseam seats a little bit low it's a little wide it pushes your legs out uh, a slight bend in my legs flat foot uh, let's talk about it's the 750s it's got the showy shocks Brembo brakes I'm pretty sure yes uh, same old cluster it's had for years uh, Definitely aggressive. Do you want the 750? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I like that it has a gear and a decatur. Uh, my leg is hitting the engine case right now as I'm standing here. Um, obviously, once we get riding, once we get moving, you won't have that to worry about. Love the sound, want it for scare. But yeah, sitting here with my feet down, my uh, my leg is like right against the engine case. So that's something to think about. What do you think I just gonna? This is a sport bike, so it's a very aggressive stance. My feet are way up high, way up high. <laughs> Like that, that icon jacket. That's a pretty cool jacket. Um, this is the Sub D bike. If you follow Sub D, you know he rides a Jixer six or a 750 Salt the Womb. Exact same uh, paint scheme as he's got on his bike. I was looking at the price on these things, and brand new, the 750 is like 12 and some change. Which I don't think is bad because the uh, R6 is the same price. The uh, Ninja 636 is a little bit below this. I think you can get on one of those for 11, but I think this is a good price for this bike. It doesn't have it has it don't have rider modes. It's smooth in first gear. This sound this thing's loud holy crap this thing's loud it's fairly smooth on the throttle listen to 
listen to this thing. Oh, I like the sound of this bike. I like the sound of this bike. The brake pedal is real low. The foot brake is real low. The toe's about pointing the ground. So if you don't follow my channel and you're just stumbling across this, you should go check out my YouTube channel, Woody on Two Wheels. I do where I reviews, I do motor vlogs, just me driving around and talking about stuff. Uh, today I already rode the Kawasaki Z900 2017. I'm riding this bike today. I'm also gonna be getting on a uh, BMW S1000 single R after I get off this bike I also think I might be doing a ride on the Kawasaki uh, the little uh, Z125 uh, they told us that uh, since we signed up to ride the uh, Ninja you could uh, at any time you could go over and ride the uh, uh, Z125, they got this little uh, course in the parking lot there with little cones and stuff. They ride it through or whatever. And uh, I'm, if I get a chance, I'm going to ride that. Gosh, this is fast. Gosh, this is fast. I love this sound. This thing's loud. This thing is loud. Way louder than my bike. Way louder than my bike. I'm telling, this might be, this is louder than the R6 I rode. This is louder than, it's about loud as a thousand. Definitely as loud as a couple of thousands that I've rode. Right here we're getting on the highway but we're getting on it and then getting right back off the way they talked so Ooh, that was fun that was fun Let's see if you can uh, smell that exhaust. See if you can clutch or shift us. Yeah, you can. It ain't very smooth, but you can. I uh, I was just riding that Z900. No rider aids, no rider modes, no. Uh, it doesn't have the quick shift or anything like that, but you could uh, you could clutchless shift it pretty smooth. This one's a little rougher. Uh, dude, we're cruising at 55, five grand, and fourth gear. Let's get it up in the sixth gear. Let's do a roll on from four grand, five grand. Yeah, this this bike sounds mean. This bike sounds mean. We're definitely. This is a definitely more spirited ride than that uh, Kawasaki ride. Definitely more spirited. Keeping up with that thousand up with that thousand you see that dude I think we was <laughs> we was going a little fast right there I'm not sure on the speed because I didn't look but hopefully I got that on the video that was going pretty fast right there holy crap 
Dude, I love that sound. We're still in sixth gear. Uh. Smooth downshifts, the uh, engine brake ain't bad at all, nice and smooth. Uh, it's not a comfortable ride. I mean, it ain't bad. I've been on worse sport bikes, that's for sure. Uh, you're down on your hands, so my the palms right there are starting to hurt. But they're getting a little sore, but uh, it's not like terrible, terrible. I've been on worse, I've definitely been on worse. I liked it. What a fun ride so far. <laughs> what a fun ride so far. That's downshifting in the first gear. That, and did it smooth. Did it smooth. This, this apparently is going to be a short ride. Dude, did you see us on that highway? That's a thousand. And this was keeping up with it. Unless he was just afraid of getting into it, but I was definitely keeping up with him. Oh, what a fun bike. It ain't, uh, it's just horsepower, baby. This thing. It ain't torquey, definitely ain't torquey like the uh, Z900, but dang. It's romping around in fourth gear. I like that sound. Let's get the revs up a little higher. Third gear. Let's do a second gear. Let's see if we can do a second gear. I think we're going to really slow it down. I like it. You see the... A lot of these bikes that I've been on here lately, I watch the bike in front of me, and I see the taillights just flopping all over the place when you're going down the road. But these aren't like that. These aren't like that at all, though. Gosh, this is a cool bike. This is a cool bike. I, I like the the blue uh, paint scheme. I definitely do. They have a black. They had a black and yellow. Yeah, there you go. They have a black and yellow one there, but I think I like the blue better. I think I like this team blue better. This is a good sounding bike. This thing would probably be loud as crap with an exhaust on it. This thing would be so loud. I think this is about the end of the ride. We're getting back uptown already. Next, I'm getting off this. I'm getting straight on to the S1000 single R. I can't wait for that. That's like my dream bike. It's got everything that you could think of in a bike. Cruise. Uh, it's got the quick shifter, all kinds of stuff on it. Heated grips. Uh, this is the Amp Expo. I did, uh, which that video will come, probably be coming out before this one does. Uh, I did a video of the Expo itself. So if you want to go in and check that out on my channel, 
you'll see uh, I walked around in there it's mostly uh, I don't know if you know how much you know about Amex so but I came here not knowing much about it either so but it's mostly like the aftermarket scene and stuff like that uh, but they do the uh, manu major manufacturers are here and they got their uh, uh, 2018s here and I walked around and got some videos of those you definitely have to go check out that video and you see uh, the bikes that are gonna be coming out next year and with their paint schemes and stuff uh, I got to check out the the new ninjas the ZX 10 and the ZX 6R they have an awesome paint scheme on these new the ones coming out for the 2018 sweet sweet paint job it looks so sick i love that paint like a silverish gray or something like that it was sweet but really cool paint job you'll have to check that video out and see it uh gosh this feels good leaning it this feels good leaning it over This thing sounds me. So we're coming to the end of the ride. Hopefully you like this ride review. If you did, hit that like button. If you didn't, hit that dislike button. If you ain't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe today. And, uh, and uh, I'll catch you on the next video. This is Woody. Peace and I'm out.